Some are fully aware that they've lost hope. Others have been like the analogy of the frog in the pot of water, slowly boiling to death and not even conscious of their condition. Have you turned off all care for your dreams, for your marriage, for your family? Maybe you've stopped any discipline with what you eat or even drink. You just don't care anymore. Places where you used to try to, now you don't even care because you've lost the vision or where you're going. You're, you've secretly hopeless and now you're just quietly casting off all restraint. If one painkiller makes you feel okay, then why not two, why not three? Guess what? God is whispering to you right now. He's saying, don't you give up. I love you. Don't give up. I'm the resurrection and the life. My friend, he's saying, don't give up. God is wanting to turn your sorrow into joy, your mourning into dancing, give you beauty for the dust and the ashes that you feel like you're surrounded by. Don't be condemned at this moment. Don't let criticism come up on the inside of you. Let go of it and just listen. Pay attention to what the Lord Almighty is saying to you right now. You've listened to the voice of condemnation and judgment far too long, says God. Stop it. Open up your heart to His Word right now and let the light of His holy vision dominate the atmosphere in your life. God has unfailing hope for you. He is the dream resurrector and the one, the only one able to bring what's dead to life. He is the resurrection and the life. You may feel like the loser of all losers, but God is working even in your darkness right now. He's able to build character into you to transform your life. He is the expert at seeing possibilities where there is nothing that appears of any good or any value or any use. He can make a leader, an influencer out of you, my friend, for good, for life.